An Albuquerque woman who joined the Army to stay out of trouble is accomplishing big things. In less than a decade of service, Krista Osborne has already earned a title only four other women have won. News 13 Stephanie Chavez shares her impressive story. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2022 United States Army Active Component Drill Sergeant of the Year is Drill Sergeant Krista Osborne. That's 26-year-old Staff Sergeant Krista Osborne accepting the title U.S. Army Drill Sergeant of the Year. <laughs> Sergeant Osborne joined the Army eight years ago. I really didn't have a plan, and so um, college was kind of an option. The Sandia High School graduate lost her dad in a car crash during her junior year of high school. Her grief consumed her. And so I wasn't really... Uh, motivated to do anything after his death, kind of grieving his loss and kind of started to go down a wrong path. Uh, and that's where I, I kind of decided, you know, the military would be the best option for me. Stationed in Fort Leonard Wood, Missouri, that's where she would eventually meet her wife, who coincidentally is also from New Mexico. She's actually from Algodones. This year, Sergeant Osborne competed against more than 4,000 drill sergeants for the title Drill Sergeant of the Year. For me to compete as a female was uh, a, real big, a really big statement in the Army. The Army describes the competition as one of the most physically demanding and mentally tough challenges any soldier can face. She says at 5 feet 4 inches tall and 130 pounds, the odds were stacked against her. The pressure was on. I knew a lot of people were watching me, um, but I, I knew that I was, I was very capable of doing it. She was right. After a few days of competing, her determination and hard work paid off, earning her that prestigious title. So this competition's been going on since 1969. And there's only been uh, four other females that have, that have won it. She says she couldn't have done it without her family's undying support. I mean, I, I came from a really good family. She will always miss her dad, but she knows he's proud. You know, he's always kind of instilled those values into us of, of you know, never giving up and working hard and, you know, just getting after it. She's hopeful she can inspire women to chase their dreams, no matter how tough they may be. You know, I just hope that... You know, they can kind of look at me and say, well, she did it, you know, you know so can I. Stephanie Chavez, KRQE News 13. Osborne says she will spend the next year recruiting and training soldiers. She says her ultimate goal is to retire after 20 years, buy a home in Rio Rancho, and move back to the land of enchantment with her wife and stepdaughter.